Ayano Koji finally decides to confront Hirata in order to convince him to join their class in the upcoming exam. Ayano Koji states that Hirata has been dragging the Yamauchi incident for too long. As a result, he doesn't even cooperate with the class. Ayano Koji tells Hirata that he wants to know why he is behaving like that. Hirata tries to keep quiet. Hanasa. As Ayano Koji begins to show his real nature, Hirata immediately realizes that he isn't dealing with the easygoing Ayano Koji. Thus, Hirata reveals his past to Ayano Koji. Well, in middle school, one of Hirata's friends became a target of bullying. He tried to help him, but he was afraid of becoming a target of those bullies. So, he decides to stay away from this matter. However, one day, his friend tried to unalive himself. He was saved, but he never recovered, and he is still in a coma. Thus, Hirata blames himself for this tragic incident. Meanwhile, Ayano Koji tries to convince Hirata that it wasn't solely his fault. By the way, those bullies were Hirata's classmates. Hirata then reveals that even after that incident, those bullies found a new target for their bullying. On top of that, his other classmates also began to join in to bully others. At that point, Hirata knew he had to take action. Therefore, Hirata tried to control all of his classmates through fear. Hirata used violence to control his classmates. He created a hierarchy with him on the top and everyone else at the bottom. If any conflict came up, he would punish both sides. As a result, everyone became emotionless robots. That's why Hirata couldn't tolerate Yamauchi being singled out in their class. Surprisingly, Ayano Koji blames Hirata for Yamauchi's expulsion. In response, Hirata states that he tried everything, but he couldn't save Yamauchi. Ayano Koji starts to grill Hirata. He also criticizes Hirata's naive belief that everyone can be saved. Ayano Koji goes on to say that he had misjudged Hirata. He had thought of him as a respectable person, but that's not the case. Ayano Koji labels Hirata as a superficial and helpless student who boasts about wanting to do the impossible. After hearing those harsh words, Hirata questions if that's Ayano Koji's true nature. Thus, Ayano Koji completely breaks Hirata. Ayano Koji encourages that if Hirata wants to save everyone, then he needs to fight for that cause till the end. He also mentions that even after that, if somebody gets expelled, Hirata must accept it and continue to work forward. He further adds that Hirata will lose more of his classmates if he continues to hesitate like that. Ayano Koji also suggests that Hirata should ask his classmates for help when he is struggling. At last, Ayano Koji assures him that he should be able to lead everyone now. Hirata thanks Ayano Koji for giving his confidence back. The next day, Hirata apologizes to everyone.